Why, hello there, YouTube, and welcome to a revolting review. I am Random Russ, and today I review Trap. <laughs> so, this is, of course, written and directed by the great M. Night Shyamalan. If you can call him greats, I mean, he's always a hit and miss, but what's now, he's been doing some good stuff, in my opinion. And of course, this stars Josh Hartnett, Ariel Dogen something. Um, I can't pronounce the name. Uh, Shilka Night Shyamalan, M. Night Shyamalan's daughter. Uh, Haley Mills and Alison Pill. So, this is a psychological horror thriller, more psychological thriller, where Cooper. Uh, father taking his daughter to a concert to see Lady Raven, his daughter played by that aerial girl, and Lady Raven being played by um, M. Night's daughter. So uh, in this, uh, you know, to reward her a great A's in schoolwork, he takes her to a concert to see her favourite singer, Lady Raven, and he discovers, as you see in the trailer, that the whole thing is set up as a trap to catch a serial killer known as the Butcher and of course we all know from the trailer that Josh Harder is the killer and is trying to find a way to escape and get out of this venue without being caught and goes through extreme lengths to do so by you know, smooth talking his way through some safety words and also you know being smart and calm and you know, setting out to extreme lengths willing to lie to like lie to get his daughter backstage access to Lady Raven and then she it kind of takes a turn there where she gets caught up in it all and he reveals himself to her that he is the butcher spoiler alert and of course you know, it just escalates from there, you know, things rapidly take a turn, like, you know, what is it Will Farrell says in that meme? Escalated. It escalates crazy and, yeah, we get our M. Night Shyamalan cameo as well in this, where he's playing a sort of manager or summit to Lady Raven playing her uncle in this even though he's her father in real life and yeah we um you know we all sit and await that Shyamalan twist as well that he's known for doing uh so what did I like about this film well um first of all I thought this was probably one of M. Night's better ones you know more like down to earth and realistic and what have you, um, you know, with a serial killer, it was kind of like, you know, how they, how venues at Manchester Arena would go after those tragic bombings. I won't get into that here. Um, but yeah, I liked Josh Hartnett in this. He's an actor that is sometimes good in stuff and sometimes not so good and in this one I think he was good he did a great performance playing Cooper the butcher and yeah despite the trailers making it obvious and giving it away I was always waiting for that big twist like what if his daughter is the killer that he's covering for or and I thought what if his wife is the killer um, who was played by Alison Pill who I know from American Horror Story and Star Trek the card and uh, we also get, um, what's the name, Haley Mills as a profiler who, you know, knows just about nearly every move of the killer. And, yeah, uh, I also liked the actress playing Lady Raven. Shirts, is it Silka Night Shyamalan? Uh, you know, M one of M. Night's daughters, he, one of his other daughters, made her directorial debut earlier this year with a film called Watchers, which I've yet to see. But his other daughter is an actress and appeared in this film as Lady Raven. 
I thought she did somewhat of the interesting performance before. And um, yes, kind of like uh, kind of like Nicki Minaj. That vibes I got off her as well. Well, of course, like pop artists today, I guess. I don't really follow the music trend today because I'm like, um, but yeah, with M Night Shyamalan, I thought. There's got to be a twist on this, but just shows a little spoiler here now. I don't think there, there wasn't a twist in this, unless the twist was that his wife knew and suspected it of how she worked it out and alerted the authorities, and that's how the trap got set. That was the twist. But then again, if there is no twist, what if that is the twist in itself? That there is no twist, like his other film he did, Lady in the Water. Or signs, unless the twist was the aliens are allergic to water. Anyways, um, crap. It had some comic relief in there. It had one character in it named Jamie, played by Jonathan Langdon. And he had a little, he, he did a little comic relief in this, playing a, like, arena attendant. Uh, and I thought, he was funny. He makes a little, you know, um, a little mid-credit cameo, uh, not a mid-credit cameo, he plays a supporting role in it. He makes a um, a mid-scene credit part in there, there's a, a mid-credit scene in there where I just had a bit of a chuckle because I'm like thinking, yeah, yeah. <laughs> and he was a little funny as well, I thought. Um, but yeah, I guess I was a tad let down with there was not much of a twist and the trailer pretty much gave away that Eo Cooper was the killer, the butcher. Um, so, yeah. Uh, what am I going to rate this film? I will probably give this... Um, like I said, it's one of them nice better ones, I think. You know what I mean? Last year he had Knock at the Cabin before that old, and before that was it Glass. Yes, yeah, so, like I say, M. Night Shyamalan is a hit and miss, can't please everybody. On this account, I was impressed by this film, it was suspenseful. It was like, you know, is he actually going to get away? Is he going to do it? Uh, and that. But yeah. Does he get away? I don't want to tell you that, you got to watch. Anyway, yeah, that's it for this one. So ratings, I will give a uh, crap. I think I'll give it four stabs out of five. Yeah, I think it's worthy of four stabs on this one. So there you go. There is my review for this one. Have you seen it? Let me know down in the comments below what you thought of it. Did you like it? Did you not like it? And be sure to share with your friends. And like I said, feel free to subscribe and hit the notification bell. Helps me out, but that's your choice at the end of the day. And all the social media links are linked down below in the description. So yeah. So. That's it from the, from this one. So until next time, do not have nightmares.